The default mail client on Ubuntu is Mozilla Thunderbird. I'll browse to it from the dock. When you open it up for the first time, you're prompted to create an email address if you don't have one, using a provider called Gandhi.net. Or you can use an existing one. I'll choose to use my existing email. I'll enter my information here, my name, my email address, and type in my password. And then I'll click Continue. It looks like Thunderbird found the account settings for me, so I'll click Done. Of course, your settings will be different, so you'll need to check with your email provider if the automatic settings don't work for you. I'll click over on my inbox. And Thunderbird downloads my email. There's my messages. I can click on one, and it loads down here in the preview pane. I can check for new mail by clicking Get Messages. And I can compose a new message by clicking Write. I'll type in a recipient. I'll set a subject. And I'll write the body of the message. I can also attach files if I want to. I'll click on Attach and a file, and I'll browse to my pictures. And let's attach picture 02. Then I'll click Send. And once my message is sent, it'll show up in my Sent folder. Working with Thunderbird is pretty easy, and there's more to it than I can go into here, but I just wanted to give you a quick look at how to set up email with a default application. There's another client you might explore called Evolution, which brings email, contacts, and calendars all into the same application. Especially if you use a cloud provider that offers all these services, it can be a good all-in-one option.